Hey everyone, it's Selby. I wanted to make this video to just quickly announce something that I've been planning to do for quite some time actually. I'm, you can see it from the title, I'm making my old Sonic Eraser repository with the source code public. And actually that repository includes everything that I've ever worked on for the Sonic community. Way back to 2008 actually. You can find the link in the description, the GitHub profile is public for everyone and you can do whatever you want with it. As to why I'm doing this, I could probably give you a quick explanation. You see, back when I joined the community, the golden rule was basically to never ever share your source code. Never. Sharing your source code, let alone having somebody's source be part of your own project, was seen as a major point of drama. You would not have your source code stolen, because if that was going to be the case, you were fucked. And you see, I used to follow that mindset for literally years. Even long after I stopped engaging with the community, because I haven't produced anything new since 2016? Damn, that's a long time ago. However, since the years without me producing anything have steadily gone by, it felt more and more disheartening that my old work is simply left on the old git repo without ever seeing the light of day again. Therefore, making the source code for my old projects public is a way to circumvent this digital decay, if you want to call it that. By making it accessible to anyone who is interested in it, there's at least the chance for people out there to find some value in my old stuff. I also believe that sharing the source code for my old project is an opportunity to give back to the community, no matter how insignificant that contribution may actually be nowadays. I'm well aware that a lot of time has passed, and most, if not all, of the tools and techniques that I used in my old projects will certainly no longer be relevant. But that doesn't mean it should stay locked up for all eternity, especially when there's no reason other than ego and maybe pride involved. So yeah, link is in the description, do whatever you want with it, I really don't care. If you see anything that you want to use in your own projects or maybe want to pick up some of my old stuff and work on it yourself, feel free to. And if you got any questions, feel free to reach out on the YouTube comment section or on Discord or maybe even the GitHub page itself. I don't really care. That's pretty much it. Thanks for sticking around and I'll see ya. Bye bye.